This YouTube story, Cat Walked 12 Miles Returned to His Family, <laughs> reminds me when I was a kid, I don't know, uh, eight, nine years old, and I used to go out every day, and this is in the, in the city, I would hunt for stray dogs. I took some chain, my father had a big roll of chain, I'd clip some chain off, I went out hunting for dogs. Well, I came back with a dog one day, and I was going to keep it. Named the dog Ginger. And I went to school uh, two blocks away from my father's radio and TV shop. Well, it was radio at that time. No TV. And I come back, and usually Ginger would be in the shop waiting for me, coming back from school. No ginger. I come back from school. No ginger to be found. I asked my dad, I said, where's ginger? And he said, son, Cordy Typo, I gave uh, ginger away so that he could have a good home. Better than what we can give ginger. And I was so sad. He says, yeah, I give it away. People, Ginger will be very happy because the people who took Ginger uh, live on a farm. And the farm is about 25 miles outside of Detroit. You can imagine that, hitting farmland in 25 miles. But back then, you could. So, sadly, I said goodbye to Ginger in my mind. About a week later, Ginger shows up at my dad's store, all dirty and scruffy. Ginger had run away from the farm and found his way back all the way through Detroit traffic. Traffic, crossing streets, and came back to me. Good old ginger. So this story here, Cat Walked 12 Miles Returned to His Family, reminded me of my own uh, pet return story.